Hello ladies and welcome back to It's Time for Tea. My name is Princess Nay and this is my femininity journey that I decided to share with you. Before I get started ladies, please follow me on Instagram at callmeprincessnay. Follow my femininity page at The Indigo Woman. And ladies, please don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe to my YouTube channel so I can reach more feminine women across the globe. Okay, ladies, so now let's get started. So, ladies, before I go into today's subject, I just want to be very clear about something. It is perfectly okay to be the main character of your own life. Um... I always had the it girl mindset because I always made sure everything was about me, make sure it was about my happiness, make sure I wasn't doing anything that was making me sad or miserable um, because I would just be completely against it and I just wouldn't do it. Um, And I think that whatever you want in life, always make sure you're placing yourself in a position to be the main character um, and to make sure everything serves a purpose in a way that in the long run, you won't say that I regret doing this or that. So personally, you know, what I've learned is to put my happiness first, which changed me for the better. Um, Now, for starters, I would suggest that you deprogram any and all negative thoughts you have about yourself or your environment. There are a lot of individuals who put things into the world about black women or women in general that we just do not support supposed to have nice things we're not supposed to live in luxury we're not supposed to date men who are providers um we're not supposed to just have a good life we're supposed to struggle and always be you know getting the shirt end of the stick and i just do not believe in that i love the way that the world is changing where women are just going after everything they deserve and everyone else has to you know catch up i really love that for us um You know, I'm not the type that is going to bash other people or men in general, you know, just because, you know, they are not giving it to us. But the ones that are given things by a man, I love that too. Um, But I am also happy for women to go out into the world and get, you know, everything they feel that they deserve. I'm here to tell you that, um, you know, it's just perfectly okay to be that level of happiness you know whatever car you want whatever town home you want you know manifest it all and go out and get yours you know whatever brunch place you want to go to I just highly recommend that you go out and get it and doing those type of things will put you in the place of being the main character now I'm not saying that you won't receive no type of hate because that does happen when you are a woman who walks around with her head up high and you have high confidence you know some women just don't like being around women like that they like women to be like more like with their head in the water but you know as high value women we're just not doing that you know we're walking around with confidence we're going around you know showing people yes we deserve more um and I love that for us um you know also you know being a it girl this will also consist of creating better skin routines night routines you know taking care of your body in general doing daily activities um, that's good for your mental and your physical health. You know, all that plays into it as well. You know, you can dress nice, look high value, but if you don't have the mindset of taking care of the inner you as a woman, um, you'll just miss the whole like it girl, main girl type of character. Um, I highly suggest you get rid of, you know, any habits of also procrastinating. Ladies, I know that we all have gone to a point where we all have procrastinated um, one time or another in our life. You know, if it's with school or, you know, daily, you know, activities, getting things done. Um, What has helped me is putting on hourly timers throughout the day. Um, I used to be stuck on one subject all day. And I used to feel so frustrated because I didn't get anything else done for the day. And I just didn't like that. Um, I personally want to make sure I get like at least five different things done a day. So I put on an hour timer and then um, in that hour I get done what I need to get done. And then also when I'm putting on the timer, um, I'm taking breaks in between during the day, about 10 to 15 minute breaks. Because I want to have that type of mental 
you know, um, relaxation where I'm doing something fun, like, you know, looking at clothes or looking at a vlog or looking at Pinterest or anything such like that. I just do something fun just to make sure that I stay level headed. Um, when it comes to, you know, your main goals, I will always say, you know, make sure you are dedicating a nice amount of time so then you can level up your life. Um, I know a lot of us get sometimes caught up in social media and um, we don't get a chance to, you know, look at what we need to do in order to live those type of luxury lifestyles because a lot of them are fake online. I will be honest about that. A lot of them are fake. But, um, you know, it's okay. You know, you can create your own Pinterest board. Um on Pinterest of the life that you would like to live as a it girl, you know, no matter if it consists of a bunch of roses or a bunch of pink stuff or a candlelight dinner or traveling, shopping sprees, you know, eating at little cute little calves, eating croissants, you know, in like Paris or whatever, you know, put those on your Pinterest board, which you can also make in a vision board, which would be considered an it girl vision board and make sure you're doing what you have to every single day to relive those type of things. Um, and it doesn't have to be perfect, ladies. It can just be full of luxury that you feel you deserve. Um, I want you to also know on those Pinterest boards, you should definitely make sure that you're getting enough rest um, because you always have to get your beauty sleep. I know a lot of entrepreneurs or big business people push that, you know, you get three hours of sleep and you're back up and you're doing what you have to, you know, to make sure your goals are complete and that's just not healthy, ladies. You know, being an it girl is not going around with puffy eyes all the time. Um, you know, always being tired, not getting the proper nutrients, not eating correctly. Um, that's not part of being an it girl. It girl is someone who takes care of her inner self. You know, an inner woman is very important just like the outside is. You know, you're beautiful on both ends, so you have to take care of it. Um, you know, like I said, make sure you're eating a healthy breakfast, a healthy lunch, a healthy dinner, um, research on Pinterest, which you can eat. I know for me being plant-based, I have to go in there and look at different eating ideas. So I don't continue to keep eating the same thing over and over. Um, and that's just something that I do as someone, as an it girl to remain healthy and, you know, continue to embrace who I am. Also, as a main character, you have to continue to embrace your femininity, you know, so you're trying out new jewelry pieces, new handbags, new shoes, new t- new type of dresses and skirts that's more fitting to you, um, new like makeups and hairstyles that will put you on a different level compared to everyone else who do like all the same type of looks. You know, you have to embrace your inner femininity and see what works for you to give you that it girl factor. I know many of us aren't where we would like to be, um, but, you know, as a feminine woman, I just find it important to keep God in your life and continue to reading affirmations every morning and saying to yourself, okay, this is what I have to do. This is what's going to keep me motivated and things as such like that. You know, it's just simple things to um, become that girl. And I I wish that on every single woman who's hearing this, you know, it's okay if you want to become the main girl. Um, mainly if you get friends that are main girl characters, you know, that also is definitely helpful as well. Um, mainly when you're using certain perfumes and lotions and just looking like luxury, ladies, I just highly recommend it. But that is all for today, ladies. Um, you know, if there's anything that you feel makes you an it girl, please leave it in the description box. I would definitely appreciate it because maybe it's something I can use, but remain classy and beautiful. Mwah.